Hi guys, welcome to another video from Paul here at CCTV Systems UK. Uh, unfortunately, we're all still in lockdown, so we're going to carry on and do some videos. This one's from home. Um, today we'll talk about Hike Vision Video Loss Detection. Uh, Hike Vision Video Loss Detection is software that's wrote into the actual DVRs, uh, which allows you to get a notification through to your mobile phone if there is any video loss on your system. As you can see in front of you, there's one camera up there on the left hand side and all the rest of them say no video. If we were to take that first camera away, that no video sign would come up and of course you would then get your notification. So why do we want video loss detection? Well, it's got two purposes. Uh, first one is of course, if you get a camera that doesn't work it's gone faulty you will of course get a notification or a bleep through to your from your dvr to tell you that it's gone faulty uh, but secondly more importantly if you have some cable that's in a not a secure place it's running on the outside of the building and it's low down uh, then if someone was to cut the cable god forbid then of course you would get a notification through to your mobile phone with a pretty little picture of the camera concerned. So let's do a quick setup to video loss detection and then we'll put it to the test. Uh, this is a 16 channel uh, 4.0 interface height vision DVR. So of course to get the menu up we right click, up to the settings tab, left click and then down to the event tab on the left hand side, left click. So it brings us directly onto the normal events. We've got motion detection, video tampering, video loss, alarm input, alarm output, and exception. So the third one across, video loss. Uh, you've all seen these before in our previous videos. Blue here stands for continuous. And of course, you can click the non button and take out any of these sections that you would like. So it's continuous from midnight across to midnight and of course, Monday through to Sunday. So we won't mess with that. We'll leave that on 24 hours. Why not? If it's going to be on video loss. All we need to do, though, is make sure it's enabled. We tick this box and press the apply button. Then we go over to linkage, which is here. And if we left click on there we get the linkage settings here. What do we want the DVR to do if someone does cut a cable? Well, everybody wants Notify Surveillance Centre. So we click that. That's, of course, the notification through to your mobile phone if you have your DVR networked. And we'll also select the audible warning, which is the bleep from the DVR itself. And we'll also have full screen monitoring uh, ticked which means it will jump onto that camera concerned when the video loss is detected. And we apply it. It's that easy. So it's armed 24 hours a day, and our linkages are the surveillance center, the audible warning from the DVR, the bleeper, and the full screen monitoring. So left click on live view, and I'll right click on this border to get rid of it. I'll also double click. So we can get all 16 cameras back and you will then be able to see the camera jump on when, of course, it senses a video loss detection. So I'm now going to simulate a video loss, a cable being cut by unplugging the camera in the top left hand side. And we should hear the bleep from the DVR. I'll get a notification through to the phone and we will get full screen monitoring. Here we go. There we go, we've got the bleep, and the full screen monitoring has come on to say that that camera has been tampered with. I'll plug the camera back in. There we go, so the camera's back in, and up and running again. So we'll do it once more, I'll leave it on the full screen this time, and again. And another notification has come through to my phone. 
that's fantastic so there you go guys that's the height vision video loss detection facility uh, if you want to take it off of course just nip into the uh, start of the menu and just unclick the enable button and apply but it's always worth having that on on your dvrs and this is paul logging off at cctv systems uk goodbye <laughs>